And I was wondering about what 2015 would be like, because three years in the future seemed like a really long time. However, my years here at Terman have flown past me so quickly, and now I'm standing right here in 2015. Now, probably most of you eighth graders re reflecting back on your Terman experience might remember how science game was like, or a sport you did. And while I do recall these events, I'll see a lesson that I've learned, which is, if you want to try something, just go for it, and don't care what others think of you. I've seen so many times when I, I wanted to try something new, but was afraid of what others would think of me. And one example was back in seventh grade. I wanted to join the basketball team. However, thoughts like, I'm not gonna be as good as everyone else started swarming my head. And so I didn't join. And initially, I didn't see the big impact of my decision. However, when eighth grade came along, the same problem unfolded. But after hearing the encouragement of the staff and students to take chances, I joined. And in the end, I, I was really glad that I had taken a step out of my comfort zone uh, because I made new friends and enjoyed being part of the team. And maybe some of you guys have also had an experience like mine. And that is why I want all of you to remember this quote by Winston Churchill. A pessimist sees the difficulty in every opportunity, but the optimist sees the opportunity in every difficulty. And so before we're all on after high school and later on in life, I just want to tell everyone to just be yourself and to seize the opportunity when you get it because you may never get it again. And that we're not living life to the fullest if we're hindered by the perspectives of other people on us because we decide where we want to go in life. And lastly, I just want to take these last few moments to thank all the teachers, the staff, the administrators, and all their families for their support and encouragement that they've given to us to help us succeed and thrive. Thank you. I would now like to introduce our next speaker, Gabby Falk.